Welcome back, brothers and sisters. I am Brayden. This is Langley Outdoors Academy, and thank you for stopping by. All right, the content for today is all about the Second Amendment and how the support of the Second Amendment is changing, but it's changing in an amazing and a dynamic way. There are some things in here, guys, in the video that we're about to talk about that are so crucial for us to address, not only address, but to share, okay? Did you guys know that in 2020, over 5 million guns were sold in first-time home buyer, or uh, gun buyers from March to August, and the number only continued to climb through December? Would it surprise you to know that 58.5% of the increase in new gun ownership was from African-American demographic? That's mind-boggling, and that's amazing. Because guys, I don't know, and you guys can leave comments in the field on this part of the video, because this is the crucial part that I think needs to be spread and we need to talk about a lot more. Just like this American flag behind me, the Second Amendment is not made up of one color. It's made up of all of us coming together to form something greater. And that's a big thing on our channel. That's what we've been hitting for so long. Why are we so positive? Why are we so driving towards the unity? Why, why when in the face of all the things that are bad happening, are we positive? And this is why, guys, really boiled down. Because no matter your politics, no matter what, there's a different reaction to stimulus from an American standpoint to the rest of the world. And what I mean by that is I can look simply into 2020. For example, the right for the, for the American people to buy a firearm is guaranteed and enshrined in the Constitution. Okay? Right. Every single person, every single demographic, every single subset of any strata that you, they want to put you in a bucket. But the main thing is, the solution that Americans will tend to go to is, well, if you're not going to do it, I guess I have to do it. And that's what we're seeing here in this report. I've linked the article below. It's from The Guardian. It's from a British um, newspaper. But what they're hitting on is there is a growing representation in the Second Amendment movement of the African American population in big cities like Los Angeles, in small cities or in smaller states like Mississippi, Alabama, all across the board. They're taking their ownership of their self-preservation into their own hands, regardless of the catalyst. I'm not here to talk about the catalyst. But when you had an entire year of talking about defunding police and Second Amendment is bad, you had the largest growth of a home of a gun ownership in the African American community that's on record. 58% guys. And that's the crucial part. The amazing thing that we're seeing, and this is what I always go back to with positivity on this channel, we may have the odds stacked against us. We may be seeing European socialism and just honestly mob rule come across. But in the innate fabric of our being in this flag, we handle our problems ourselves and that is huge and from i can tell you firsthand from my perspective if you happen to be in one of these demographic groups that aren't traditionally second amendment supporting welcome brother or sister like get in here this is a free zone and i will support anyone's right to bear arms it's not just one color on this flag it's the entire thing and that's the message that we really need to drive home guys is this report gives us hope and it gives us a positive direction because everyone is going in that same direction of self-preservation. And the sooner that we realize we're in this together and we align to those ideals that we know we can do better and we can do it together, we will be in a much better place. And that's what this channel is all about. That's why we're hitting so hard always on positivity, why they're having such a hard time passing gun control. Their key demographic voting blocks are picking up firearms at an unprecedented rate. What do you think that's gonna to do to the Second Amendment gun grab push that they've been doing? How long until that Second Amendment goes into a different amendment, or goes into a different ideal like free speech? How long until the rebellion starts to go against, wait, you can't stop me from saying something on my platform, on what I want to do, you can't silence me. That's the point and that's what those, these people are so afraid of is a separate group of people joining a freedom movement. And that's what we're seeing happen guys and it's amazing and I'm amped and if, again, if you are part of this group, welcome in. You're welcome on the channel. Any questions you want, throw it in there. We are driving together, guys. And we're going to end up in a great place. And don't anyone let you think that you don't make a difference because you do. Until tomorrow, I'm Braden. See you later.